No wonder why there's no tag. It's reversible. Roscoe Soul Train! Yeah, baby! First stop of the day, Santa, Santa Rosa! Rosa. <laughs> Who's this? Parker Brett! All right, let's go in here and see what they got. Redwood Gospel Mission. Yo, Brett, I found you some chicks, bro. Yeah. Take them home and... Mmm, vintage box. Came across some 2010, 2012 World Champion shirts, but for eight bucks, I don't fucking know. Even though the tags are still on them, I don't know. Give me a break. They're not that cool. Fucking Brett over here spots this Carhartt jacket in here. 4X. But look at the fucking price. Used, they're about the same anywhere else. Jesus is hard up, man. All right, well, uh, Jesus, I don't think was with us. Saved all the garbage for us. Yeah, there was nothing in there. I got one shirt. The prices were fucked, man. Everything that was there was either through the roof or ridiculous. Yeah, not or not good. It was one or the other. All right, let's go to the next one. Hey. Subscribe and wriggle it, dingle it, do. All right, spot number two. Pick of the shitter. Yeah, man, we got shut out on this one. I was really looking forward to supporting the frisky frow lines of Sonoma County. You know what? We, I got a special spot that we're gonna go to. It's right here. Can you believe it? We're gonna get some food. This is the best taco truck in Santa Rosa right here. Delicias Elenita. It's been a staple for years. And yeah, we're gonna get some fucking elote and some uh, delicious taco meat. So let's go, all right. Get that out of my face. Lunch. All right, next up of the day, we're at the Salvation Army on 4th Street. I have found some good deals here. This is not a bad place for antiquities. They used to have a really good DVD and Blu-ray section. I bought all of um, the Wonder Shows in seasons here. You remember that show? No. Oh my God. Uh... Uh... If you guys haven't seen Wonder Shows, and it's a really good show, it was on MTV back in the day, it was fucking weird. I found all the seasons here for like two bucks a piece. Fingers crossed we find something because we've been getting shut the fuck out today. Browsing the Blu-rays and what's this? Yes. And look at this, Aaron Carter. Wow. wow. Sealed. Yeah. I feel like all these dudes look like, like three feet tall. Just me. Looks like they have the same hairdresser too. Okay, so nobody's gonna give a shit about this, but dude, this record right here changed my fucking life. Oh my God. Wow. I was in a band with the drummer of this band for a short period of time. This CD, this is it right here. The Conspiracy, Too Far Gone. Best album ever. One of my top albums of all time. This is the one right here. I can't believe I found this. One of the problems when you find heat like that in the CD section, you find yourself digging through mounds of shit for fucking days. It sucks because it's like, goddamn, you know what? Am I gonna find next? Am I gonna find some old rap? I mean, am I gonna find some cherry pop and daddies? Fuck, I don't know. Checking out the glasswares, and these are old. Wow. 70s, I think. Damn, dude. Foghorn and Leghorn. Cool old Looney Tunes shit. I think I'm gonna pick up on these. They're too old, too cool. What'd you find, dude? Anything cool? No. Nothing? Uh -huh. I love Phuket. <laughs> it's always funny to find these. They're like these knockoff shirts that whenever the Giants would win the championship, there'd be all these booths on the side of the road that'd be selling all these fake ass giant shirts. And this is definitely one of those. Brett found another one right here. This is a Fear of the Beard. Yeah. City. Look at this. This is pretty good. A pre Baroid era logo seven, San Francisco 49ers. 97, not bad. There's a couple little wang janglers on there, but you know what? I can sew. I'm gonna pick it up, dude. What do you think? Oh yeah. Yeah, baby. Dog shit. Dog shit. Oh, what, dude? What'd you find? No way, dude! Land of the free, little eagle boy. Wee, 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 wee. Yeah, I found this little baby shark shirt. This is definitely old, probably like early 2000s. Pretty cool, but it's just tiny, unfortunately. <laughs> found some single stitch over here by Mango Man Casual. Sorry, okay. I was just getting acupuncture on my hoo-ha. Well, I don't know about that. Here's an interesting find right here. This is like some old scrubs. I don't know how old this is, but tag is still on it veterans administration medical center from topeka kind of rad don't know anything about it hitting a weird vintage look here retirement it doesn't get any better than this single stitch this is definitely a pickup fuck yeah dude hilarious here's a law enforcement san francisco giants night oh my god i'm sure that when they get were giving out these shirts the booze sales were through the roof because cops there's one thing that they do know how to do is party hardy oh my god protect and serve and play ball and get fucked up and do fucked up shit yeah baby <laughs> suck my balls Hell here's yeah. a cool chicago white Sox shirt i think it was a giveaway night or something like that still a really cool logo i don't think i'm gonna pick this up though mm. Dude, could this be any shorter <laughs> i yeah it really could be at this point it, it'd be nice if it just cut off right below the titty you know it'd be a really good look for either of us you know god damn hot 
Just go to a homeless shelter. This is kind of cool, this junk food Golden State Warrior shirt, but dude, what the f are you kidding me? Dude, There's no fucking way. I don't know, man. These are what the fuck? These are looking like a score. No way, dude. I mean, what size are these? 12s? 13, too. Perfect. Shit, dude. Tall boys. Are they fucking real? I don't know, man. What the fuck? Jordan's in the thrift? Dude. No way, Brett. I've All right, been, what's the verdict, man? I've been bamboozled. You think so? No, there's no low strap. Yeah. And this isn't stitched, it's printed. Yeah. Would you rock them? Not a size 13. No. <laughs> Clown shoes. You could be a leather daddy, man. Baby. Yeah. So, <laughs> you don't got to ask me twice. Browsing through the, uh, the jacket section, and here's a zebra-lined Nike jacket. I don't know anything about it, but... I think I'm gonna pop on this thing. This thing's fucking cool, dude. I think it's fucking cool. Yeah, I had good luck with some Nike stuff. Heck yeah, dude. See what the price is, you know what I'm saying? Oh, dude, Brett, dude, check this out. This thing is reversible. Dude. This is on that zebra. Hoo ha, hee ha. This is a heater right here. No wonder why there's no tag, is because it's reversible. And look, That's so zebra. Sick, dude. Who doesn't love zebra? I don't. I, do, I love it. This is. Oh, yeah, baby, right here. Ooh, ooh. I gotta say that place was a good time. <laughs> Let's go. Yo, Brett, did you pick up those Jordans? Nah, those things are fugazis. Oh man, that's too bad. Roscoe, what'd you get? Okay, cool, man. So I got this Conspiracy Too Far Gone CD. I was in a band with the drummer, Dimitri. I talked about it earlier. If you guys haven't heard this album, I suggest going on Spotify or Apple Music and checking out the Conspiracy Too Far Gone album. One of the best ska records of all time. Love this thing. I'm so glad. I already have a couple copies of this, but anytime I find old ska, I pick it up because they don't fucking make this shit anymore. It's fuck a thing of the past. I also found this 1997 San Francisco Giants pre Baroids era. Fucking, it's got some holes and some dings and some damages, but you know what? I'm a good sewer. I got oh, this yeah. retirement. It doesn't get any better than this vintage single stitch tee. This is the kind of shit that you just find in LA thrift stores for like 20, 30 bucks. So I love this kind of stuff. It's fucking beautiful. So I pick up that and then. One of the best things I picked up today this. is gorgeous fucking, not a flaw on it, Nike fucking fleece, double, double-sided Wambo Jambo jacket. And then the last thing that we picked up were these 1976, 1973 uh, Looney Tunes old, is this Hanna-Barbera? What's this? Yeah. I think it's Hanna-Barbera. Yeah, that guy's definitely kind of Warner Brothers. Brand, yeah. I don't know. And then here we go. Here's some, uh, you know, Wiley Coyote and Meet Meep. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so we picked that up. Um, we still got a couple more spots to hit up, so that was a great store. Prices were okay. Anyway, let's move on and find some new shit. <laughs> <laughs> Check out Roscoe Soul Train on eBay. Well, it looks like God wasn't with us in Santa Rosa today. Unfortunately, we're at the Goodwill here, which is unfortunate on many levels because we've resorted to going to the Goodwill. We've both scored here, though. Yeah, it is usually actually kind of far. So unfortunately, it's closed. There's a, a free crockpot over here. But just like today, it's broken. Um, not like this jacket, though. This is this thing fits like a fucking glove. All right, we're gonna find another place. We're not gonna get shut out like this. Let's go find another. <laughs> Brett, where are we? We're at the Sizzler. What <laughs> Sizzler? Is that what this thing is? No, nah, man, we're at the Sutter. Sunk a month end. Okay, Sutter, cool, man. I'm not sure if you guys remember the fires that were caused by exploding PG&E meters and or a laser beams attached to airplanes. Direct uh, energy weapons. Yeah, direct <laughs> energy weapons. We're basically in that neighborhood. We're gonna go to the Sizzler over here. I think at one point in time, this was a sex shop that was called, what, Sal Salamanders? Slipperies, Sizzlers, <laughs> Slipperies. Yeah, so, so we're gonna go and we're gonna see if they got anything good because, man, we're already doing pretty good as it is. Yeah, baby, all right. This looks a lot older than it is, but does anybody know what a steam donkey mile is? I feel like I could smell the guy that would wear something like this. Hey Ross, you find anything else? Dude, check this out. It's a corduroy Laguna Seca Raceway, I don't know, newsy hat, but check it out. It's got the snapback in the back. Dude, this is a fucking double heater right here. Wham, bam, wham, bam, wham, bam, wham, bam. Wham, bam. <laughs> Came across a Brock Hampton shirt in here. I called him Brock Hampton. Brock Hampton, fuck yeah, dude, they are sick. I love Brock Hampton. Bro, what did you find here? College, this is huge by the way. College, let's see that back of that bad boy. Oh yeah, dude. He's like my inspiration right now. This is ridiculous. 45th Festivus with Guy Fieri. Oh wow, are you gonna buy that? No, that's all you. No way, dude, we're like, we're inspired by him with our hairs. Oh, actually, I could probably fit into this. <laughs> Be a night tee. Yeah, you better. It's got a sick logo on it, Scott Berkeley's. What is this, 
wicked sick monster truck situation kind of cool i'm into it oh dude that's sick dude i think big dogs is coming back man oh fuck yeah how could you forget it they were the fucking shit back in the day i do think they're coming back though by the way i don't doubt it man nope trash 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 you ready for this one what oh four Look at this, you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Huge ball. Oh, that is sick, dude. Whoa, cool. 04? Yeah, man. Yeah, that's pretty sick, that's dude. Huh? I'm into it. Man, it's local, too. Yeah. Infineon? No stain? Does it look like? No. You scored, dude. That's your size, too, right? I think so, yeah. Yeah, baby. Here's some old track crew shirts from, like, Monster Jam. I don't know where they were from, but they're kind of rad. These are, like, fucking kind of old, too. Like, United States Hot Rod Association track crew 2005 they're kind of sick and for you know two bucks i think we're gonna pop on these ones brett what did you spot dude you're finding all kinds Wait, of cool stuff what is this toys are us. oh dude the train that's cool you see jeffrey in there i think you gotta buy the whole thing but damn dude that's sick another thing i found in the kid section boom look at this the hobbit fucking sealed bro uh score yeah baby bro did you wow dude that's an old one look at that oh it's so cool uh-oh, I got one of these at Disneyland a long time ago, but this one, that's an old yeah, one. Dude. That's really that's cool, dude. Shape. Right on. Good find. Good pickup. All right, Brett, so what'd you get, man? You went with the big old tire blaster on the back. Yep. Had to get the Guy Fieri. <laughs> dude, that thing is tight, man. There's so Fucking much A, man. On. Can't go wrong with the Gi. And then you also got this over here. Birds. Little baby birdio. Yeah, cool, and this is what I got. All right, man, so first thing that I got, I got this Johnny Gill and Bobby Brown cassette tapes. These are always fucking good to go. I got Time Bandits, the Terry Gilliam movie. I don't know if you guys have ever seen this movie, but it's fucking wild. I sold a DV Blues I got a copy a while ago. Uh, sealed, The Hobbit. Yeah, cool, awesome. Got this Brock Hampton shirt. Beautiful, lovely. Brock Hampton, great band. Uh, Monster Jam t-shirt. Fuck yeah. Track crew, track crew, yeah. Scott Berkeley's wicked sick monster truck t-shirt. Somebody must have been like dumping off all their monster truck shit. United States Hot Rod Association 2005 track crew shirt. I got this Nike dry fit jacket. Beautiful. Yeah, baby. And I also got this fucking stunning Grandpa Buick soaring flying eagle. You know, got the little weird little whippity do on the front. Never been worn. This thing is a fucking peach and a gem. Ah. Oh. Yeah. All right, let's go to the next place. We did good. <laughs> Thumbs up, brother. Yeah. All right, we're at the next location. What is this place called? Sutter Hospice. Same place, Sutter. different location. Is that my guy? And then we're gonna score here. This is gonna be a good one. Fingers crossed. And yeah, let's go. <laughs> Over at the Blu-rays, wham! Look at this. Road to History. Barry Bonds. Oh my God. Gotta love Barry Bonds. He was the freaking best bass player I've ever seen bass player <laughs> when you're browsing blu-rays and dvds always look inside because this would have been a sad one damn whoa what is this no it's idea. like a little locker <laughs> dude owen nolan was sick dude this guy was so rad loved okay. owen nolan yeah. must have been a giveaway back in the day yeah. 250 dude that's a score bro thanks man here's a weird one look at this barbie at epcot for a birthday party i think i might just have to get this for myself fucking strange came across this mommy's video they were from my hometown and they made it big with a sitcom on like cbs or nbc or something and i also got this lick of godzilla vhs not bad i'm totally gonna pick up all of these not to mention this 2014 world championship sealed dvd blu-ray tip of situation go back out and we're gonna take a boom anything good over here man yeah, oh, that's kind of cool Fucking sick. Hop to it. Here's a fucking Shamu. Jesus Christ. How sad. SeaWorld. Oh, look at this fucking weird thing. Jesus Christ. That's like nightmare fuel. Oh, that's kind of cool up there. That's Mickey. Checking out their selection of hats. I found this kind of interesting Cobra Ball hat. Interesting. Hey, What's look this? At that. That's for your old buddy Randy. Randy? Who the fuck is Randy? Yeah, baby. Cal Ruckus. <laughs> Those are kind of cool, actually. Whoa. Getting Randy. Yeah. All right, cool. So I got a few things. I got this, like this uh, giveaway. I think it's a. Uh, it was like a locker room situation by Owen Nolan. Owen Nolan was a great guy. He had a couple of bars and restaurants in the San Jose area. He still might. I'm definitely gonna put this on my shelf. Came across a little Godzilla VHS. Here we go. Boom, boom. Wham, bam. Bing, bong. And then uh, the 20, 2014 champion, champions of the world. Check out them, Vincent. Giant Giants. Also, uh, breaking. Ah, fucking a, man. Good haul. Oh yeah, last but not least, helicopter unit. Uh, this fucking great vintage 
uh, uh, Sumpak hat, and um, I didn't end up getting that Cobra Ball hat. They wanted a little too much money for it. It wasn't considered to be a dollar tag because it wasn't clothing, they said. Fucking liars. Anyway, let's go Let's go to the next spot and wrap this fucker up. <laughs> well, Brett, what do you think, man? How'd you do? Not bad. I got enough stuff for me, so I'm so... I think I did pretty good. I mean, all in all, to find vintage, to find some cool VHS, to find some... I mean, this jacket. I mean, look at this fucking thing. I mean, it doesn't get any better than this jacket. I would say that it was a great thrifting day. I'll definitely have some stuff on sale on my eBay page. And there's just a couple of things I wanted to touch on before we close out this video. Number one, Brett, where can they find you, man? Bogger Brett on Instagram and YouTube. All right, cool, man. Yeah, man. All right, and the last thing I want to touch on too, I'm getting no traction on YouTube, which is fine. I'm just starting back my channel again. What I wanted to say is if you guys know anybody that loves weird stuff, share these videos with people that you like and say, oh, there's this weirdo that I watch and he's got some weird ass friends and they almost get kicked out of stores. My eBay store, all kinds of stuff is on sale all the time. Probably will sell this jacket at one point in time, but I'm gonna list it for a pretty penny because I love it. Another thing I wanna to touch on, I'm gonna be liquidating a bunch of my inventory. I think I'm gonna do it either live on YouTube or on my Instagram page. The link is down below to that. So. Look out for that. If I do something like that, I'll be doing some kind of announcement about it. Um, but yeah, thank you for your continued support on these videos. If you like these, share them with people that you think would like them as well. Also a thumbs up and then leave a comment down below and let me know what I'm missing out on. If there's anything that you want, also leave a comment down below. And uh, all right guys, thank you so much and enjoy the rest of your day. Fucking fuck off. Huh? Check me out on my ebay page and if you want to subscribe baby that's all right and you can check me out on my ebay